we go. Question eight, 800 points. At a party, or it could be anywhere actually, uh, there are two people named Pat, three people named Robin, and three people named Sam, Sam, and they're seated at random around a circular table. What is the probability that each person is seated next to at least one person who does not have the same name? Is it five sevenths, 53 seventieths, seven factorial minus 72 over seven factorial, or seven factorial minus nine over seven factorial? All right, no questions, but again, feel free to ask if you have any. And for this one, you have 105 seconds, a minute 45. All right, it's about 45 seconds, still a lot of time. All right. Uh, so there are some things you can do to simplify this maybe, or you can just count it out right. Uh, and I think all those ways give you the same answer. Uh, one way, just eliminating three people, that doesn't work. Uh, but other simplifying methods do work. Uh, for example, uh, you know, it's a circular table, so shifting around uh, gives you, will buy, and figuring out that way if the shifts are equivalent or not equivalent, they should give you the same answer. But anyway, because uh, so, we want to see who, uh, who chose what, here we go. Uh, so two people chose A, two B, one C, and two chose D. Yeah, wow is right. And we'll see what the correct answer is. It was B, 53 over 70. And so Luke looked happy about that. Timothy, was that happy or not happy? That was happy? All right, well, so we'll see uh, what that does to the score. Congratulations to people getting that right. Uh, so Luke got it right, as you can see, with 3,600. And then I guess Andrew didn't. Uh, sorry, Andrew. Uh, and then Timothy, remember, he was happy. So he did get it right. He is 3,000. Uh, Andrew's 2,800. Alex, 2,500. Eric, 2,000. And Jay and Ben uh, with 1,500. Uh, so how about a hand for all the contestants? I'll come congratulate them. Uh, Luke will be here for uh, the finals.